students were able to ask a question. How did your experiences in the military help prepare you for being an astronaut and going into space? And astronaut Mark Vandehei answered. I hold on to something with my feet, and then I have both of my hands the impact on the kids that this is something that is going to make them dream big and pursue, you know, mathematics and technology and engineering. Faculty and staff at Pine River Bacchus wanted to demonstrate to their students that even in a small town, you can dream big. People like this were like us in a small town, in a small school, don't get to do stuff like this very often and it's we're just really cool that talking to somebody that's in space. Miles and 19 of his classmates were selected to ask the astronaut a question. Inside I was kind of tickled. I can't imagine what they were feeling. I felt nervous and kind of excited. There were a wide variety of questions based on personal interest. I always wanted to become an astronaut or something to deal with space, so it's really cool to hear from an astronaut. Seeing the reactions of the students was the best part of the day for Robbie. I was so proud. Um, these kids who were so nervous beforehand, they were confident and eloquent, and you could tell that they felt important. Each year, as few as four schools across the United States get selected for this star-studded experience. It's astonishing that we were chosen. We're all very excited. After the Q&A session, students headed to the gym where they were able to learn more through hands-on experience. Mr. Vandehei is an engineer and I want to be an engineer when I get older, so see his perspective. Showing students of all ages that they can be shining stars. And they can do amazing things no matter where they're at. A day that can only be described as... For this week's Community Spotlight in Pine River, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News.